Hello there, this is Space Runner 5. Welcome back to episode 14 of our Bohemian Let's Play series, where the Empire has been consolidated greatly. Um, we've gotten rid of Saxley and, and Brandenburg, so we are down two electors. So now we have Trench, Padua, Paderborn, Brunswick, Friesland as our current electors. The only two that are still the same from the beginning of the game is Mains and our, ourselves. Which is kind of weird to think about. See, our truce is almost up with Tuscany, and then we're going to go ahead and declare war on them and free up a bunch of these little miners again, which will be fun and exciting. We are missing a leader. Let's go ahead and recruit another one. 334, not great. It's also not terrible. What is our army tradition? We're at 66.7. Definitely not too bad. Definitely have been in quite a few wars to keep that nice and high. And, oh, I clicked on China. Uh, we do have three voting, three people voting for us. So the election is barely in our hands, assuming they always vote for us. On that, not too bad. Alrighty, Tuscany. I'm going to go ahead and start Annex Hungary first. I think we'll do that. I think that's pretty much all our... Di yeah, we're not going to gain any diplo points now. Going back from Hungary, and then we're going to declare war. Tuscany. You have Switzerland and Bologna. Bologna is an OPM we don't care about. Provence, we're not giving you any land. Switzerland, do we want you as a co-bliterate? Who do you have as friends? Just Bemington, can we still spit out the three leagues? Nope, the three leagues is gone. Oh, here we go, we got uh, Geneva that we could uh, split out of you. I think that'd be worth it. Not Naples, Tuscany. So there, you go over to Memington, who has Protestant Zealots. Form up and make your way over to Switzerland. All of our little OPMs are going to do, just do a little bit of carpet sieging, hopefully. I guess we're going to take care of these Protestant Zealots for Memington. Not too big a deal. Let's go over to the capital now. Definitely didn't have to do that for them. Especially since we're at war with one another. But, ah oh well. Doesn't make that big of a difference. And do we think we're going to be able to complete this before we complete the integration of Hungary and... Lithuania. I think so. That is our primary focus right now. National focus, skills, power projection. Yeah, I think so. Shouldn't, shouldn't be too big of an issue. This fort is probably going to fall pretty quickly. Let's go scare uh, Switzerland and peace out Memington. Can actually release two guys out of you. I think that'll be well worth it actually. We'll spend the double points to get two additional princes that are both Protestant. I guess we'll burn the power project or the uh, 50 double points that we just got. A little sad, but not the worst thing in the world. And then we're gonna go over here and prevent them from taking this hill fort. Come on, Lithuania, follow me. There we go. Our army is very strong. Lost 6,000 and killed almost 14k. There's one fort that has fallen. And now we'll come over here to Milano. Is there a siege leader? No, he is not a siege leader. Do we even have a siege leader anymore? Nah, we have one pip in siege, not nothing great. Alright, Memington. You know the deal. It's only uh, 64 dipple points, or 54. That's not bad. Lost a leader. Is he important? Ah, uh, he was kind of important. They're all doing stages though. Which means we're gonna suffer quite a bit of attrition. Just because we are still in our combat stacks, because Tuscany's right there with their army. Austria? You, you've done a thing. Where'd you even take the land, actually? Here. Uh, I, would t I wouldn't mind having a Tyrol. Can we split off anyone else? Not really. It's not super worth it uh, to fight Austria. Where are you allied to? Anyone? My 
you care about. Salzburg, Memmington, Padua, Mulhouse. Not really, because Padua, you're inside the Empire, though. We're also an elector, so we might be able to split you in half, too. Have, oh, Treviso is gone. We can have a Verona. That might be worth it. And we lose a stab. That's not great. Black news, Dauphine, your army is getting destroyed. That's okay. There goes the capital of Switzerland. Switzerland, I would like to convert you. Force religion is way too expensive. All right, Tuscany, this is what we want. Yeah, it's a little expensive. We won't do that, Augsburg. Mantua, Geneva. Turn course to Milan. Too expensive to take this last one. Stack wipe? I didn't even know. I uh, guess you guys just kind of ran into our army. Let's see. The war goal, Norvora. You stand there. You can do a very quick siege. Bologna, you're fine in the war. Can't say particularly matter. You'll accept. Bring back these two princes. We're both Protestant. And does anyone actually of you three princes? Do you want to be a free city? Yes. I don't think you're one of those three, though. Wonderful. That helps with our uh, imperial authority growth. Point one one. Not super significant. Geneva, Mantua. I guess we don't need Mantua. I'd rather have a Milan. Nice and strong, because they'll go ahead and expand in this region. You need a leader. 4632. Uh, I think that's a great trait to have. And Bologna. Actually, we want you in this war, uh, just so we can force your religion. You're not inside the empire, but no, yeah, it's principal. You guys can go ahead and meander on home. Like Lithuania is taking a fight. They are going to lose. Still end up being a very close fight. Alright, we'll go ahead and path, path into uh, Tuscany's army. Because we don't want them taking a fort. Oh, and we're just going to assist Hungary in the fight, really. Great stuff, Hungary. Switzerland, you've been fully sieged down. Gonna go to the north of our country. There are cores. Oh, we can't add this to the Empire because it's not adjacent. Well, it'll be there for later. Oh, I got a fort. Bologna. We got your fort. We're going to force your religion. And yeah, give us some money. Peace out, bud. Tuscany and... Switzerland. Uh, we're not actually... Uh, we are getting one prince out of Switzerland. Force him out. Convert our own land. It's definitely higher on our priority list. And go home. Go and start drilling. Oh, wow, you guys are all being a little aggressive up there in the north. I distinctly remember you being like an OPM. Yay, one guy. What about you, Hamburg? Goes back Holstein. I understand he's the wrong religion. Oh no, he's Protestant now. He's fine. Force religiously. Milan. And Geneva. Two less heretics. There you go, Imperial Authorities back up. Dauphine, we don't need to influence you anymore. Two provinces in the Empire are not controlled by us. 
Ragusa, Austria, Salzburg, Padua, and Mulhouse. Anyone we border, that is the wrong religion. Dalmatia, we could do a quick annexation of you, honestly. Eat you, force your land out, and then maybe go to war with Naples to get back a couple of your cores. Would get us into this region. Let me do a quick war with Ragusa, something like that. Savoy. This between borders and we're not the same religion. That can be arranged. Burgundy. We have a CB on you. This would get us to war with Savoy, in which where we could force the religion. Berg, you're the wrong religion for us. Clevs. You're allied to Toulouse, Hunt. Not really anyone we can go to war with at the moment. Baden? Nope. No available CBs. Where are you allied to, actually? Ellsberg doesn't have anyone we care about. It's you. Strasbourg, Mecklenburg, don't care. And yeah, we don't actually really care about any of them. All right, you guys can carry on. Come on back from Trent. All right, France, what is our truce up? 1622, May. Very soon, actually. Rally the troops. We're gearing for war. Who are you allied to? Toulouse, Naples, and Constance. Man, you just love allying France. Break your alliance with France. No. No CB and trust towards France. Fair enough. You may stay. Court creation cost reduction, very nice. Not that we're pouring anything, but we will be in the future when we go to rapid expansion mode. Unlawful territory. Yeah, it's okay. There we go, there's our truce with France. France, we're going to war with you, just so that, that way we can get land back by the Empire. We have lots of claims on you, dang. I almost just want to push our, our claims, but now nah, we'll be good. We'll just split out a bunch of little vassals. Call in Savoy, because why not? I have no reason not to. You are a siege leader. Let's go over to Paris with you. you go to Metz. Actually, you go to Naples. Go south. Austria has decided to get claims on us. Uh, we laugh at you, Austria. To think that you can rival us. Conversion was successful. Let's do an artillery barrage here. Really get the ball rolling. Let's go ahead and include our subjects as well. Hungary, we will assist you in your conversions. Very small stack white, stack white Ben. Austria, you're renting out your army against us. Hmm. Well, there goes Naples' army. That was a joke. Nassau, you've taken land that you should not. On both sides of you, actually. I don't really care about either, to be honest. It didn't eat anyone. Demand unlawful territory. Now nah, we're okay. Things are going fine. Actually, gain an additional 0.01 of your authority, and we'll be getting this once we take it back from France as well. Lose 211 ducats. 50 devastation in Metz. Yeah, that's fine. I would like the professionalism, to be honest. We are going to be taking a loan. Ooh, 
That's the fall of Paris. That's what I like to see. Another stack wipe. The month isn't even over. Lose stab. Ah, we'll gain the, per gain the corruption. I'd much rather have stab. As a loan. Oh well. Life happens. Good job, Lithuania, with your... Uh, the one two... Uh, okay, it's a 633 leader from Armagnac. Like, uh, Lithuania, your general is not that great. It's, like, okay. <laughs> and that's about as best I can read it. Let's see. Charlemagne's legit... Legacy? Yep, defend the empire. We'll definitely have that. Less than one province completed the Charmaine's legacy. That will be done. This isn't going to be completed, but we'll be getting there. <clears throat> Timurids end of internal conflict. Sure. Conversion into Hungary. These out Bosnia. Yeah, you did eat Bosnia there, Naples. You've insulted us. Well, fine. And you ate Brittany. How dare you, friends. Siege of Naples has fallen. Naples, we'll keep you around for a little bit. Can probably use you as a... a money bank. You can keep that land, that's okay. Everything else is still fine. That's on... Castile. Say okay, break your alliance with France. You don't need a France, buddy. Then again, I don't think there will be much of a France late after this. This army is pretty much done. You guys can go home. You've done your job. Austria declared war on all. Baden, saying cleanse the heresy. They are reformed. I think that's a, a fair reason to go to war. Alright, we are going for releasing Lorraine, Bickery, Gascony. That's a pretty big Gascony. Would I rather have Brittany, though? Or Gascony? Probably Brittany. Because I might be able to release a Gascony off one of the other princes, like Armagnac here. Yeah, I can get a Gascony. Successful conversion, very nice. Discovered someone spying on us. It's okay. I don't mind being spied on. Siege of Savoy. Ironically, Savoy just no longer has a core on it. Oh, they changed the culture there. That's dirty there, France. Octavian is over here, I believe. No, that's Gaskin. Where is the Octavian culture? That's uh, Bretonian. I could have sworn it was a French culture. Oh, there it is, right here. Oh, no. It's in the right region. Maybe your primary culture changed. Yeah, it's Piedmont now. Piedmontese? Look, France, this is what I want. I don't think you can really support fighting me that much. Well, gas, sure, you can have access because you're probably fighting for Stetton. There you go, 72. I have some money as well. One click of money. That'll do. 61 ducats is fine. And the France is broken. Where's the other army? There. Oh, it's over here in Brittany, duh. We were working hard over there. So we have Charlemagne's legacy, legacy for three Diplo rep. This will help with conversions, or uh, into 
integrations rather. Go ahead and click that. Less than one province of the empire is under the control of a non-empire state or subject, but non. Pull in. You're underneath me. Do I have to seize land from Poland? Can't can't even seize land. Well, that's annoying. This should be completed. Poland is underneath us. And now suddenly we're losing eight diplo points a month. Oof. It's a lot of uh, extra diplo rep. So what are the chances that you just get integrated or annexed now? I get a seven. You are negative thirty one. How about you, Poland? Can't be in annexed for another or integrated for another twelve years. Fair enough. Do any of our vassals actually border the uh, empire? Not really. Okay. So we can't just add them like I would like to. Ragusa, why do you not like me? Opinion of heretic. Alright, fair. I understand that one. Russia. Go for Emilia, but, you know, I don't really want to fight a Spain. You would cause me to fight a, uh, a Russia. No, thank you. Scotland. I'd like to... We can probably vassalize you eventually when we get closer to you. Um, are you a vassal? Yeah, you're a vassal. Just because you're not going to lose any of your cores and kind of gives us a little basing location. Um, it's definitely not great. But it'll do for now. Lorraine, you're Protestant. Wonderful. Two provinces outside the Empire. I thought that was Lorraine, but apparently it's Poland. Fair enough. Guess we'll just let time continue to progress. We can take tech, it's Diplotech. Oh, and France is no longer a valid rival for us. Wonderful. You have the Ottomans or Spain? I think we'll go for the Ottomans. I think we're going to be beating, beating them up here in the future. And beginning our expansion, maybe come over here and take the Ottoman steps. And maybe releasing a Protestant Crimea, something like that, and a Theodoro. Gain the stab. Stab is always great. Imperial authority is 0.14 now. Very nice. Does anyone want to convert? Baden, maybe you? I think currently you're being sieged down by Austria because of it. You guys aren't going to accept Spurg. You might, though. Oh, no, you really don't like me. Wollenberg, you don't like me either, nor does Verdan. Fair enough. I understand I've converted a lot of, uh... I guess they're former heretics to Protestantism. Go for the missionary strength. Just because he's the cheap one at the moment. I do make four ducats a month. But we're still kind of on a, uh, a tight balance. Bonian in order. Lithuania no longer has their permanent claims on you, do they? Nope. They have some claims on Russia, but it's not what we're looking for. Denmark, you have no allies. Just lose the base tax. Military leader has left us. We need a new leader. 4342, I will gladly accept that. Ottomans, what's our truce up? 1630, we got quite some time actually. Spain, we have no CB on you. Burgundy. Do we have a CB on you for cleanse, this, cleanse the heresy? Where's Lip? Might call Savoy and just uh, go to war with Lip, because we can convert them. 
Just Beardy, call Savoy in. And we're just going to feed our vassal a little bit, just so we can basically get a uh, continuous border for the Empire. That's it. That's all we want. Ooh, that's not good. And where's Lip? There it is. You go over to Burgundy. Did Lip not join? Oh, they're there. Okay. Quick stack wipe. The army didn't know what to ha what happened. There was a, a clear blitzkrieg. I don't think we're actually going to finish our admin ideas before Hungary uh, finishes integration. Hmm. We still have two, four, five. My policy is left. Alrighty, Lip. Welcome to the Protestant faith. You guys don't seem to mind this time, because it was forced instead of me politely asking, because you get a negative opinion for doing that. At least in the Empire. They're getting 0.16 pure authority. I think that's plenty. Nessa, you're still fine. Lose stab. Now we'll lose a little mixture of all. We find truce with Provence and Urbino. Not too bad. What are you fighting there, Provence? Toulouse, purge of the Toulousean heresy. Toulouse, what? Oh, you're formed. That's fine. You can get rid of that. I won't be upset. This is a Nevers. And we have ascended to the throne. Do we have an heir? No heir. At the moment. There goes another siege. I don't know if it was necessarily siege, but you know. Got there. And Savoy, we're going to convert you. your religion. That's all we want, bud. We don't want anything else from you. Alright, you guys go home. Go there. I think we'll take this province for ourselves. Truce with Great Britain is up. Wix is over as well. We do have corruption, so we're going to pay a slight penalty. Yeah, I think we'll wait till that goes away. Humili we can humiliate Great Britain. That's fine. There's a couple more boats, because we have the sailors. Not that those boats are going to do anything, but it's principle. We can have a navy, so we will have a navy. Can't enforce religious unity. That's fine. Just waiting on this fort in Savoy to fall. Other than that, this war is pretty much over. Corruption is currently at 0 0.05, 0 0.02, we just gotta wait one more month then. Alright, Savoy, you have fallen. Most tempted just to make you a vassal. Give me some money. This will go to Dauphine. You have a claim on this. I think that's okay. We can give that to you. You just want continuous borders, something like that. Maybe we do just do a full annexation of Burgundy and re-release re them. We have some cores over here in France or in Burgundy. We release Burgundy as a vassal. We have any of Burgundy Burgundy's land? No, it'd just be these. So we got a core first, and then release them. I think that'll be okay. Go with a full annexation. Bye, Burgundy. Played such played such a crucial role in the beginning, and yeah, only have to core this one province, add to the empire, and this will be their capital. So maybe we just re-release them, gain money, a new consort at zero three three. Money, which probably won't lead. Yeah, we'll take the money. We're really sad if she uh, 
ascends to the throne, though. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna take this. We have no negatives from uh, corruption anymore. Now we have four left. And Hungary's going up. At a decent rate. Could pay legitimacy and prestige for a new heir. Yeah, why don't we click that button? Give us an heir. 454, I will accept that. No, uh, we need to vote for ourselves. That's very important to us. Russia doesn't have an heir, actually. Do we contest you at all? That is. Spain, did your dynasty change? Oh, uh, yeah, because Maria's on the throne. Gotcha. Yeah, that happens. This is Austria, Memington, and Friesland. What are you guys doing? Memington, we still have a truce. Friesland. You're taking a lot of land over here, bud. You still haven't eaten a prince, so I guess we'll just go ahead and demand land. Give up upper, just because it's a fort. That's a big chunk out of gallery that's missing. Austria. Alright, Austria. I've had enough of your, your you know, your crap. We're going to war. Yeah, we go ahead and start annexing Dauphine, really. It'll also slow down the uh, rate in which we are annexing uh, Hungary and Lithuania. Maybe actually give us some uh, Diplo points. <laughs> we don't have any. Take that royal marriage. Be 150 monarch points? Wow, that's actually pretty expensive. I'd rather not gain the corruption. One more days. There we go. Annex you. Yeah, we're gonna fail this just because, you know, we have no navy. That's okay. I don't really get a choice in the fact that we have no navy. Let's go for national taxes. And Austria. You've displeased me. The last time. It's probably not the last time, but... Yeah. That's okay. Guys, go. We're gonna get Treviso back as a prince, who is gonna be reformed. Alright, that's kinda sad. That sucks. Uh, Fortune will be able to convert him instantly. Navy is probably gonna get destroyed. Oh well. Uh, we no longer need to influence you anymore. Uh, Milan? You're inside the Empire. I don't need you, to be honest, uh, in my life at the moment. I'd rather have a Normandy, really. You're too big. How about a Picardy? I'll take a Picardy in my life. Siege of Mulhouse is already over. You're already Protestant. You can stay Protestant, to be honest. Just demands and get out of here. Hello there. Well, I gotta cut this episode a little bit short. Um, the, uh, well, I guess short is a relative term. Uh, my hard drive filled up, so we went ahead and skipped forward six days. Um, sorry about that. You know, I forgot. it's been a long time since that's happened, almost three months, so kind of thought that issue had resolved, but you know, apparently I went over my terabyte of data that I had for uh, my alternative hard drive. So, if you enjoyed today's episode, please like and subscribe. Have a wonderful day.